Sure is here in West Texas. We'll be expecting some snow this weekend. While most people do have a warm place to go, some will be stuck outside bearing the cold. Mm, tough. Mm -hmm. Big Two's Gian Kim joins us now with more on how those without a home try to cope during these cold winter months. Gian. That's right. Well, I was out at the Odessa Salvation Army today, and their manager, Chris Cooper, tells me every day when the clock strikes five, swarms of people rush in for food and shelter. These cold winter temperatures have many people cranking up their heaters. However, director of Odessa Link says that's not an option for a certain population in the area. We do have um, homeless individuals, and they're not always necessarily the people that um, you see on the corners um, asking for a job or um, looking for a place to stay. We, we do have quite a bit of households that you wouldn't even realize are homeless. She says cold nights are just another obstacle for these individuals. They're seeking shelters, they're staying in cars, um, they're reaching out to support systems and, and possibly couch surfing. Um, normally when they do that, then they know that it's for a limited time. After working for 40 years for Rocky Bose Flug, circumstances have left him without a home. There's a lot of work here, but uh, for some reason I have a problem getting work. And I check out, I have a driver's license, went to school for 12 years, social security card, but uh, for some reason I don't... Uh... But he says he's been surviving on the streets for three years, thanks to all the community support. I think you measure a guy's wealth by not how, many, how much money he has, but how many friends he has. Chris Cooper of Odessa Salvation Army says their doors are always open for people like Rocky. I know that we have a warm bed and we'll feed them and we're happy to have you and that's what we're here for. So it's the love of Christ and that's what we try to show. Cooper tells me they feed about 100 people every day. And while the cold months may bring more people in, homelessness is an issue year-round. Jian Kim for Big Two News.